as i mentioned in my previous video if you want to know the full tutorial let me know in the comments and i got some requests for to full tutorial so i have created this tutorial uh, you can directly skip to uh, 2 minute 24 seconds for uh, map animation you can use any png images of uh, aeroplane or even if you want to use a uh, car you can use car png image here i have created this png image of uh, aeroplane open google maps and uh, search for your location where you want to take the screenshot uh, and the screenshot should contain both the source and destination like uh, from where the trip will start and where the trip will end so it should cover the screen and you have to take a screenshot some color correction here uh, and uh, you can skip this um, you can use the original image of the map no need to do any color correction if you want to make it little bit colorful you can do some changes here here we have to delete the text and we have to add object and we can adjust the color to red or blue as per your uh, convenience the border should be darker and the inside color should be lighter so don't directly uh, change the size by reducing the scale y instead uh, you can use your pen to drag it down or your finger you can use to drag it down then you can change the scale y so here we can see the border the project file is in the description link you can download the file and you can try it yourself Here I'm adjusting the start trip and uh, destination trip. So once done, you have to go to cropping, and you have to make a keyframe. 
at the beginning you have to crop till the right side complete till right side then at the end you have to uncrop so we have to keep the png image of aeroplane on top of uh, this object and now we have to adjust the aeroplane uh, moment with that uh, line Make a keyframe at the beginning and reduce the aeroplane size to zero and then you can move the cursor a little bit further at 30 seconds and you can make the plane a little bit bigger and you have to move it a little bit forward also so the line should be exactly behind the aeroplane Drag the image to the destination side and then at the end you can reduce the airplane size to zero. Yeah, now the plane is moving forward and the line is exactly behind the band. Now we will add a shadow to the path and to the aeroplane and uh, we have to add a little bit blur. And also we have to adjust the location, shadow angle. Then I make a copy of uh, aeroplane image so we will get all the keyframes which we have created for that uh, aeroplane the movements of the aeroplane increasing the size and moving from source to destination all the transitions are copied so we can keep it below the aeroplane shadow then we have to move the shadow little bit uh, upside that should match with the shadow of the path. Save this file Now we have captured the path moment and uh, aeroplane moment and we have saved it There is no zoom effect nothing just simple map with the aeroplane and path moments Now we have to 
create a new project file and uh, we have to bring this video here and we have to make a keyframe so that we can add a little bit of, little bit of zoom effect so here I am zooming see when you change the uh, image uh, when you move the image so there is a keyframe is created so later we can delete that yeah delete this one yeah just uh, we have to adjust the video on the screen with the zoom effect that's all at the end again you have to bring back to the normal size of the video so it looks a little bit filmic like a moment of camera like that then save the project uh, this is my first uh, voice over tutorial